Hello everybody and welcome back to episode 3 of Riverbend, Riverbend Springs and look at this It just stopped raining and my tires are still wet and I got mud on them Now oh, that's new on FS22 um, I have done a couple of test videos regarding contracts and yeah, there's something <laughs> really strange going on with a contract I took on uh, last night in August. Uh, but first of all, my fields are growing. My spinach, let's go into the drone here. My spinach, my grass, my, what was this again? Beans? Yeah, green beans. And my big grass field. Uh, looking at the, this one here. Yeah, so this one needs fertilizer and this and this. I don't know why this doesn't need it. It's grass. Uh, but I've only went over one time with it. So maybe... Yeah, fertilizer, 100%. Maybe grass only need one layer of fertilizing. You know what? What I haven't checked out is my chickens. <sighs> Have we gotten any eggs? And have the small chicks grown up. Oh yeah, we got eggs. Oh, cool. Real eggs. Well, at least they look like real eggs. Let's see, this is 210 kilos. And still, I cannot pick them up. Nope. It's still, uh, still a little chick. It hasn't grown up yet. I guess there are several videos on breeding animals. Tip of advice. Uh, look for Mr. Sealy P's um, tutorial videos. They are usually the best in my mind. So, let's fertilize. There we go. Now, what about a worker with this guy here? This one here is a really wide spreader. And I wonder, do we get... No. That's a shame. Um, what I'm saying it's a shame, I'm thinking of the minimap. You don't see the, the fertilizing stages. Let's see, let's see what this guy is doing when it comes to... <laughs> it's only one, one headland and then he's finished. You know what? I'm gonna hire a worker and let's see what he does. You know what? Let's see if when the worker is in it. No, we don't get any indication of um, fertilizing stage. But there we go. Well, that's a strange angle. All right. So strange contract. Let's move to it. So last night I picked up. Um, yeah, lit. <laughs> Literally, I picked up a stone picking uh, contract. But here's the thing. The, I leased equipment and the equipment is still here. But when I go into contracts, look at this. The contract has been expired. And looking at the bottom there, I lost $600 on this one. But you know what? The equipment is still here. Let's see if the stones are still here. Let's see. I think it's down here somewhere. What? Oh, I need to be on a different menu. No, what field was it? Field 70. Let's visit field 70. Bam. Visit. Yeah! Man, the stones are still here. So, yes, I need to test if we can pick up these stones. I know it's not a gold mine, but uh, maybe this is also applicable for other type of contracts. All right, here we are at the stone picking contract, which has expired. Let's see if we can pick up the stone cell now. The vehicle is the cell for contract only. Ah, okay. <laughs> the contract is finished. The stones are still here, but 
I'm not able to um, pick up the stones. All right, now we know. Now we know what that timer is. It's actually a timer um, for when you actually have to complete the contract. So if we go into here and into contract, let's see this one here, cultivating 15 hours and nine minutes. You have to complete it within 15 hours. Hmm, interesting. So what happened if I, you know what this tractor here, um, I assume that the tractor you can use, you know, uh, if you want to have it on your farm. Uh, the stone picker is that that's an implement uh, equipment which is locked to the contract. So I'm not. Yeah, I don't think you can use this on your farm. Uh, but this guy, I assume you could. So I'm gonna finish the contract. Let's see here. I've taken on another one also, a bale wrapping one. Oh yes. Let's see, collect. Bam. The mission was collected and I got $600 in fine. All right, the worker is finished with fertilizing all my fields. And there's not even a spot left on the fields. Perfect job again by the workers. Uh, I just realized that my cows are um, out of food. You know what? I, I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna take the silage bales from the uh, bale wrapping contract, and uh, we're gonna try to feed them with uh, with those bales. Uh, what I'm also thinking about is these wrapped bales. You know what? I haven't found out what this is this is saying required wood beam planks long it's a small shed I have no clue what this is this is but anywho seems like we got some uh, honey also cool so yeah, bale wrapping, uh, bale wrapping contract. Uh, I've also done a test on that, and I know we can, you know, take the um, wrapped bales into either a food machine, but a TMR mixer, in other words, or uh, we can sell it. I did sell it at animal dealer. But what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to keep those bales. But the thing is, once if you have the bales on the ground and you complete the contract, it will disappear. So, do, do, do. it's round bales. So I have this one. We can pick it up with. Uh, we could always test to put it in a silo. If not, I'm gonna. Um, I'm gonna, yeah, what am I gonna do? <laughs> I'm not sure yet. All right, here we are. Whoa, at the bale wrapping contract. Let's see. Okay, it's a little bit more bales than the other contract, but it, this is also paying out pretty good. Ooh, I just have to remember, you know what that is, is when you're doing a contract like this, uh, what's different from FS22, when you did the bailing contract and you did everything, these bales there will not turn into silage straight away. So if I give this to the cows now, let's see, let's unload this bad boy. This guy here is not silage. No, it's grass fermenting. And I know this one here takes 24 hours. So the thing is, how long is this contract valid for? 15 hours. Oh man, that's gonna be interesting. Uh, can I keep the base for 24 hours? You know what? I'm gonna get the fine for not completing the contract. Ah, oh, shoot. This is gonna be an interesting one. 
Yes, I'm inside a tanker. I bought myself an um, 8,000 liter tanker. And apparently this one doesn't have any collision on it. <laughs> so, um, I think this is a water point. It's only one way of finding out. Let's see. Yeah, start filling. And it's water. Perfect. Free water. No, the money is going down. No, <laughs> it's not the free water. What? This is a water well on my farm, but I need to... Hmm, that's strange. How much is 8,000 liter then? How much do I have to pay for my own water? Alright, coming up to 8,000 liter and that costs 2,400? Gucci mama! What is this? Oil? Man, that is expensive. Huh. Speaking of water, I need some, some kind of uh, washing tool also for my tractors. <laughs> we need to go in the shop and see if we can find something to wash. Let's see here, buddy. Can we overload water here? There we go. Dump water. All right, perfect. And um, I brought up my contracted silage bales. Uh, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try first of all um, to take one of these bales, which is not silage yet, but I'm, I'm gonna try to put it in my silo. Let's see if this one takes bales. The rest of them, I'm gonna, you know, keep on the ground here. I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna keep the contract. Even though, most likely, I'm going to get the fine for it. Let's see here. Yeah, 5,000. Shoot. That's a lot, actually. I'm thinking of it. But again, uh, what we got here? We got uh, 5,000 liter. 15. So that's 75,000 liter with silage right there. Alright, let's dump these guys. Unload her. Whoa! What was that? <laughs> was that a woodpecker? <laughs> Man, that was loud! Alright, unload bales here. There we go. Lower platform. Oh man, that's a big woodpecker. Alright, let me uh, grab my John Dale there and my spikes and uh, let's see if my silo takes baits. Okay, it's grass. Alright, you knew that. Come on, buddy. Take baits. No, nothing. It's not sucking it in. No. Shoot. I'm just a little bit worried that. Um, I'm a little bit worried about the contract fine of $5,000. Um, because I need to wait 24 hours now for these to turn into silage. Let's see. I can't remember what happened in my test video when I put them in an animal food mixer. Did it turn into grass or did it turn into silage? You know what? Let's uh, let's uh, go in there. Let's uh, lease ourselves. Uh, this is is this also a mixer? 
I thought this was just a straw blower. What does it say? A forage mixer. Takes 12,000 liter. This takes... Yeah, I'm gonna take this one. I'm gonna lease this bad boy. Bam. 2,800. Yeah, let's do that. So, I found myself a washer. Um, but the thing is, usually when you're having these kind of washers, you get the map in the background so you can place it. So, yeah, I'm a little bit uncertain about this guy. Uh, we can buy it, but we can also lease it. I'm going to lease it. Pick it up at the shop. Can I hand carry this one? No. What? Enter vehicle? What? Start engine? <laughs> Can I start the... Uh... Alright, so I need to drive this one all the way back to the farm? You gotta be kidding me. Are there lights on? No. Or I can just keep it here. Whenever I... Let's see. Jump out. Let's see. There we go. Alright. That's more like it. And now you can see. Can we have a flashlight? Yeah, we can have the flashlight. And washing the vehicles. You can see now the tires are getting wet. The black plastic there is getting wet. Good. Alright, let's try to put some silage into this one. This is brand new. Alright, let's see here now. Let's see. Will they turn into silage? Are you sure it turned into something brown when I did the. Uh, Test video. Gotta love the details on this uh, game. Let's see how now, buddy. Let's put that in here. No. Oh, you know what? When I did the test video. I waited. Oh yeah, I did it after 24 hours, of course. Yeah, now it doesn't say anything here. Oh man, can I start it? Uh, unload here. Oh, that's gonna unload some grass, I think. Turn on. No, that's because it's grass. You. Dumbass. Alright. I'm gonna try to pick this bad boy up again. Let's flip this out. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought I've done this before. Uh, yeah, okay. So I'm gonna get a $5,000 fine, uh, most likely. Um,. Well, we're gonna probably, well, I, I know we're gonna get, what, 75,000 liters of silage here. Uh, but my cows are in need of food. Oh, oh, oh. So, in the meantime, until tomorrow, I'm gonna give them hay bales. Even though that's not the most efficient. At least, they got something. Uh, if there's no other interesting contracts popping up, I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna skip ahead to uh, tomorrow. Uh, all my fields are fully fertilized. Do they need lime? No. So they are all good. My animals are good. 
yeah, this Walt contract, maybe I'm going to do in between. Uh, it's going to take a whole lot of seconds, but it was, was it not dead wood? Not harvesting. Wow, 13,000 of cotton. Um, rock remote, this one. Wood transport, borrow item. Yeah, I'm going to do that one. Oh man. Yeah, this is. Uh, oh man, okay. It's this kind of type. Okay. I regret it already. <laughs> right place and yes the worker did all the driving up there and she did it perfectly I'm causing some traffic issues now um, I found one drop point and I assume it's her looking at the contract yeah the con <laughs> it was a long drive all the way from southwest to northeast corner in the contracts it says uh, let's see be careful not to damage them as any damage will deducted from your pay. Penalty per tree, 2,000. Reward per tree, 550. Wow. Okay, so I got... What, how many trees do I got? Eight or something? Eight, two, three, four, five, six, shoo. Nine, two, three, four, five, six, two, seven. <laughs> so, let's see what happens. Do I need to unload tree by tree, or can I just drive over her? Let's unload. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Do I need to take one and one tree off now? Or is there a tipping function on this one? Pole timber trailer. Bells? No. So, I need to take one and one. But here's the thing uh, it says reward per tree 550. Is that uh, plus the contract itself? It's only way, way, one way of finding out. If that's the case, then these kind of contracts are not that bad actually. Don't damage it. You know what, let's check now, let's see if we get any information about this tree. Yes. Type. 5 meter transport tree. 648 kilos. So I guess if they are damaged the mass will probably get reduced. Let's see here now. Let's uh, gently pull this down here. And top right corner says still 0%. There we go. Oh, come on. I am on the right place here. Yes. Top right corner. Let's go into the map here. Yes, we are here. Uh, visit. Bam. Yes. This is the manage point. Oh, no. Oh, okay. I need to go here. I got $9. <laughs> oh, man. One tree was 36%. What? So that means... Oh, no! Oh, okay. 
<laughs> no, it was not one tree. It was okay, okay, okay. Now I got it. Um, you need to go here, of course, to uh, sell wood. Ah, okay. But why did I get nine dollar? Did I? Yeah. <laughs> why in the world did I get nine dollar? Okay, I'm gonna use the driver system again. Set destination. You're gonna do all the driving back here, buddy. Bam. There we go. And now I'm gonna do some work on my farm. But I'll see you in October, I think. Yeah. So, just out on my morning routine. Checking my fields, which are good. Uh, the animals are most likely out of food now. Let's uh, let's have a check. Yeah, and you see this one. Uh, the bait wrapping is still it's completed, but it's not you know gone out of time. I don't know why and how. Uh, no, they still got hay. Hmm. All right, and they got water. Yeah. Let's see how much are they worth? Two thousand three hundred. I have no idea on uh, the value of the cows. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know. And the big thing now is these guys are they silage? Yes, silage. All right, buddy, let's fire up this bad boy and let's see if we can get. Uh, what? Why does it say grass? What? Or maybe... Silage! 5,500 liter! Silage! Silage! Everything is silage! Why? Does it... Oh, now it says silage! I'm pretty sure it said <laughs> it said the uh, grass. I'm just I'm just gonna test. You never know. Maybe the my silo is taking silage. Okay, a little bit unused for this third person. No. All right. Let's try. Let's test out the cows then. Bodies, you like silage? My buddy, suck it in. Oh, yes, it turned brown. You like it, buddy? Yes. Yeah, food is going up. Look at that. And yes! <gasps> so now what we need is a place to store all of these uh, bales. Now what I could do... Is because... Yeah... Um, I'm just gonna test something out there. To take these silage bales now into here and then drop it into my... Uh, Silo. Yeah, now it's turning into silage. Let's see if we have a multi fruit silo or not. There we go, and we got silage. Come on, overload. Overload, buddy. No. Let's see, tip side left, tip side right, nothing. Uh, tip side left and right, unload here, no. Oh man! Oh man, oh man, oh man. What to do? What to do with these guys here now? Um, I'm 
wonder if we can tip in here now, or we need to have the bale inside. Yeah. There we go. Wow, it's full. Oh yeah, total capacity is full. So, what to do with all the silage before I complete the contract? You know what? I've looked in the shop and uh, constructions and silos and sheds and tools to keep these in. And there's only one I've found. And that's the one that crashed my game. You know what? I'm, I've saved the game here right now. Um, so I'm gonna try it one more time. And yes! What I did do, I also found myself a washer. Let's see, if we go into all the way up here now, into tools. There we go. Now can we drive this one? Bam. There we go. Let's see here now. If we can move it. Enter vehicle. Yes! Aha! So that's much better. Alright. So, let's... Um, okay. Um, yeah, this shed. Uh, let's see, that was under uh, do, 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 silos, and it's this one here. This one did crash my game. Uh, I did place it here. Bam! There we go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go and grab myself one bale. And let's see. Let's disconnect that one, and let's uh, let's try it again. You never know. Oh, kind of heavy there, buddy. <laughs> All right, so this is uh, where my game crashed last time. Not when I put them in, but when I tried to take them out again. Yes. All right. So. It says I got two round bales of silage in here. What if we now, in slow motion, try to take one bale out? Will it crash my game? Come on, buddy. <sighs> okay. Cross fingers. Bam. I'm gonna take out... Let's take out both bales. Bam. And... Yes! It happened again. <laughs> My game crashed. Nothing is working. I cannot tab into a vehicle and none of my controllers are working. So yeah, I need to go all the way into the start menu on my PlayStation. God. All right. Don't do this at home. <laughs> All right, you know what? I found out I'm just gonna sell the silage. But here's the thing. This is where you have to be aware. This is, um, <laughs> yeah, this is something to be aware of, that for sure. So what I have, first of all, uh, if you look on my um, food mixer on the back there, this one has a capacity of 24,000 liter. But if you look on the right side, it says silage 29,500. Uh, and that's because I put a couple of extra bales in there. Uh, because what I'm hoping is, once we start to overload, those bales will also be, you know, crushed. But there's the thing a bit to be aware of. And that is... If you're doing a silage bale wrapping contract, don't sell the bales because the bales will not give you any money look at this I'm at the animal dealer the bale is disappearing and I didn't get any paid loose however put the silage bales in a food mixer like this
Oh, you know what? The bales disappeared. Now it says 24,000 liter. But anyway, okay, I'm not gonna do that again. Selling loose silage. Money is going up and all is good. So, to wrap up wrapping silage bale contract, don't sell them in bales. There we go, we got 8,700 and the contract. I think is still active. Yeah, it's still active. So I'm also getting paid for that. So I'm gonna now. I'm I'm, I'm gonna fill it up with only twenty-four thousand liter. And yeah, until we get some modded sheds or. Uh, modded silos which can take silage this is the way of doing it and yes you might commenting on saying yes we do have this and that already but remember we haven't played the game for a week yet and um, we got what four mods and none of them take silage all right second load um, I do have uh, what well, one and a half bales still on my farm and I'm just gonna show you what's gonna happen if you complete the contract but you know now I've delivered for what 17,000 in silage and if we jump over here now now this is the tractor that came with the contract and I got one and a half bale here so I'm gonna complete the contract now this guy here collect bam and we got 4200 for the contract and 17 for silage so yeah wrapping silage bale contract is actually a great way of making money um, just make sure you uh, you know crush the silage bales into uh, loose product or give the bales to your cows Alright, I think that's gonna be it for this episode. Uh, I've just taken on a rock removal contract. A worker is driving. Uh, but that's gonna be for next episode, I think. And uh, <laughs> wow, he's really going at it. Rock removal. And where was it? Over here. Let's see, can we visit? Uh, bam, there we go, visit. What? Oh, okay, it's so all the way, looking at the minimap, it's all the way on top here. Okay, we got some flags. There we go. You know what? I don't think I've... I never did that in FS22. But apparently these are the rocks that we're gonna remove. That's not too bad. Alright. Anywho. Bye bye.